Welcome back to a look at your weather. High temperatures today. We did get up to 89. This hasn't updated just yet, but temperatures were still getting up into those mid 80s, at least for today. Still not seeing much sunshine or more. Just seeing a lot of that moisture being able to come up from the south, allowing for temperatures to warm and making it feel fairly nice outside. We're also seeing that this temperature outlook, though, we were seeing that much of this eastern coast and even into the Mississippi Valley having these temperatures way above average, but looking like that jet stream is actually going to take a little bit of a turn as that cold front is going to pull that jet stream and allow for some winds from the north and temperatures are going to be feeling not cooler, but more around average for this time of the year, or maybe even seeing some of those lows into the low 70s um, for the highs for the day. But even right now, our low for tonight is 75 degrees, mostly cloudy conditions, still feeling warm and humid overnight. And then tomorrow we'll see that those temperatures though will try to climb up to the mid 80s, seeing 84 is a high, and that's even in the late afternoon hours and seeing that these showers are going to be spotty in the morning, but it's looking like majority of them are going to be staying off to the evening as well as that cold front's going to really try to track in those um, rainfall amounts into the afternoon looking like maybe a slight possibility to see some heavier downpours but for the most part just some showers it's looked like majority of the severe weather was happening currently right now just off into the Mississippi Valley and then that's going to head over into Mississippi here as we move through tomorrow and then continue staying cloudy not going to see that sunshine here until at least Friday so this is that future radar so this is tomorrow morning and then this is where we see that front moves on through and tomorrow afternoon is going to be that strongest possibility to see showers track on it through. So here's that cold front right now bringing through severe weather for Arkansas and even parts of Louisiana. And this cold front is going to continue to just keep pushing this across. This front may die out just a little bit, but then we'll still be pulling this into the Mississippi area. Right now we do have the hurricane as well that's off into the Gulf. That is a category three now, and it is looking to make landfall tomorrow afternoon. We're seeing that Michael is category three and looking at just before 2 p.m., maybe right by that uh, panhandle in Florida, but looking like we'll be staying clear of anything from Michael as it's gonna be heading off to the Eastern coast, bringing more rain for North Carolina and South Carolina, which we'll have to keep an eye on those flooding areas as well as they've already seen so much rain from the last hurricane. So seeing that again, that's going to be the strongest chance to see showers is tomorrow and then those temperatures feeling more like fall seeing 80 76 on Thursday and then Friday 76 low humidity around sunshine trying to break through the clouds and then by Sunday looking like a pretty nice day. So maybe some spotty showers for your weekend, but we'll keep an eye on those. We'll want to keep an eye on these storms tomorrow and then having some more fall like weather on its way for us.